How did it feel getting taken out by Chris? I mean, Chris, he saw a shot, he took it. I mean, one of us was gonna go home, one of us was gonna be up there. I mean, his strategy was kick-ass, he went after the top guys, he kept the weaker minions to the end. I mean, I've got nothing but respect for that guy as a friend, as an artist, as a warrior. Wow. Tyler, I mean, is, that, is that a fair assessment? I mean, I definitely was not a minion. We had a solid plan from you the get-go. You just shook hands with a guy who called you a minion. That's, that's, that's behind the scenes shit, but whatever. Nah, we had a plan to make it to the end. I yeah. should be up there in one of their places, for sure. Wow. Katie, let me ask you this. Do you think that Chris used these guys? I do think that he used some of them. I am surprised by the continuous support. Also, St. Mark is a douche. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Craig, let me ask you, what did you think of Chris's strategy? <laughs> Um, I, I feel like that he was a control freak and, and kind of take control of a lot of people in the house and once they got compromised, he kind of turned his back on them. I mean, it is a strategy game. I mean, Chris, you're up there, everybody's talking about you. Chance to respond. How do you respond to all this? I couldn't hear anything. Okay, very, very. That's a smart move, man. Sorry, that is a smart move. Well, Chris, this is a true wall-to-wall -wall solid tattoo like we've seen from you many times in this competition. It's very solid. I do like that there's a lot of detail in it.